Hi, this is Pete Stowell from Evans Waterless Engine Coolant Tech Department. Today we're going to talk about thermostats. We have here a selection of typical automotive thermostats. Um, this is a thermostat from a small block Chevy, the typical pop it valve style thermostat. We have here a Robert Shaw style thermostat, which is a replacement for that type, has greater flow capability. We'll talk about that in a minute. The stat here is a pop it valve stat that has a positive foot on the bottom to block off the bypass port when the stat opens up. We'll talk about that in a second too. With respect to using thermostats of these sorts with Evans waterless engine cooling, what we want to keep in mind is that these are designed to control the behavior of water by modulating the flow and by introducing a restriction to create pressure in the block for water to behave properly in the system at temperature. Evans waterless coolant does not experience the boiling, does not experience the vapor creation, and doesn't need to be held against restriction so we can open up the flow and process more heat out of the motor. One of the easiest ways to do that is to play with the thermostat. We very often will recommend that you install the Robert Shaw style stat in place of a standard pop it valve for greater flow, especially in those situations where you need to retain a thermostat either for cold weather driving or if you have an EFI car where the computer wants to see a stable warm up temperature. A carbureted car will often recommend that you will remove the stat entirely, block the bypass port, and push all the coolant out to the radiator all the time. You might experience a little bit longer warm up temp in the cool weather, but we feel that the uh, increase in flow out to the radiator is, is the greater issue and allows the Evans fluid to work most efficiently when it most needs to. Um, another thing we want to mention is that some newer engines, such as a GM LS motor, this is an LS pump, these have an inlet side thermostat. Also has a, a foot on the bottom to block off the bypass. Uh, this type of stat typically will have an opening point that's up to 20 degrees lower than what you're looking at on the gauge. Uh, this, is, this is because it's seeing the cooler coolant out the bottom of the radiator instead of the hottest coolant coming out the top of the motor. Theory is still the same though. If we can eliminate this stat and block the bypass port, this pushes all the fluid out all the time and will give you the best performance with Evans engine coolant. Uh, if you have any other questions about how any of this relates to your application or if you have any other tech questions, give our uh, tech team a call at 888-990-2665 or drop us an email at tech at evanscooling.com. Thanks for watching.